the years we've had. Looking forward to this launch. 15 seconds. And here we go. 10. T minus 10. 9. 8. 7. 6. 5. 4. 3. 2. 1. Liftoff of Goes U, NOAA's new to, newest Be weather satellite, to monitor the Earth and Sun in high definition. Engines look nominal. Looks looking good as you see uh, the Falcon Heavy uh, soaring towards the heavens. Uh, all 27 engines powerfully lifting goes you on its trajectory and ascent into space. A beautiful shot as we track oh, the, nominal. the rocket from the ground here. The rocket is now powering down for Max-Q. Max-Q is the moment of maximum dynamic pressure on the rocket. Max-Q expected at 1 minute 7 seconds. The vehicle is now supersonic. the rocket looking down on the earth that it is leaving <laughs> and all 27 Merlin engines providing 5.1 million pounds of thrust coming up at T uh, plus 2 minutes and 28 seconds the side boosters are going to shut off while the center core will continue on Wow, what a shot there of, again, all 27 Merlin engines firing off 5.1 million pounds of thrust. The uh, side booster cutoff will be referred to as BECO. We'll hear that call out. And then when the center core shuts off later in flight, we'll hear that called as main engine cutoff or MECO. Side boosters are performing, uh, all, all boosters are performing nominally. Everything's looking good with the 27 Merlin engines. Separation confirmed. There we see Biko and side boost. MVAC chill. Side booster uh, separation. The MVAC is being chilled down, getting ready for ignition. Once the center core. Uh, boost back startup. And there we heard the call out for boost back startup. A lot of things happening here. So again, we have the two boosters that are going to be returning to uh, the Cape here, landing at landing zones one and two. These two boosters have three burns, so we're seeing a boost back burn All now. All vehicles are following nominal trajectories. Essentially, these boosters have flipped back and are returning on a path to the Cape here. There will be two more burns, a, a re-entry burn and then a landing burn. And these are going to provide quite a show for folks that are here on the Space Coast because you're going to hear those sonic booms, Mick. Yeah, absolutely. We are uh, looking forward to those sonic booms as the side boosters landing, landing zone one and two. Uh, we're about uh, 26 seconds away from main engine cutoff and the center core separating. Once the center core separates, we will then have MVAC, which is the Merlin vacuum engine for space, uh, start, start up and get ready for what we... And this is the first time, actually, a GOES satellite is launching on a Falcon Heavy. Only the second time NASA's Launch Services Program is using a Falcon Heavy. Yeah, we launched our first Falcon Heavy with SpaceX uh, back in October of 23 with the Psyche mission. Uh, and the side boosters, actually, that, that we used on the Psyche mission will be used for our future mission, Europa Clipper, this October. So brand new hardware today for GOES U, and everything looks like it's performing very well. All the telemetry, everything looks nominal for the flight so far today. Yeah, those uh, who typically watch our Eli launch broadcast. Entry burn startup. There that we heard is... the call up for entry burn startup. The vehicles are slowing. You can imagine this as a um, brake on your car where it starts slowing the uh, uh, boosters back down very quickly um, as Eli they. Uh, entry burn shut down. 
and there we hear the shutdown as the boosters have slowed down. Next thing we will see is the landing PY, burn NY, FTS is saved. at landing zone one and two. Beautiful All imagery again. To fall nominal trajectories. From the ground as we track those boosters, make their way back to the Cape. We saw some birds fly <laughs> into the camera's view as hey. well. Everybody wants to see the landing exactly. uh, the side boosters. <laughs> uh, as we said earlier, Megan, these the landing will be exciting um, for, for a lot of people to see. Getting uh, two side boosters coming back to landing zone one and two, we will get those sonic booms. Uh, I know that uh, you here in the MDC, we will UI, get some... UI, transonic. We will Stage get two the, FTS is saved. We will get some uh, loud uh, shaking right here in the Mission Director Center. I know a lot of people right here in Brevard will be excited when they hear the uh, sonic booms. Uh, UI and my landing burn. Landing burns has Stage started up. Terminal guidance. Wow, look at that. As it guides its way back down. Whoa! Just heard the two sonic booms here in the room. UI and my landing light deploy. Our monitor's shaking. That. That